This is it right here, not bad. Each one of them has their own colors and this one is black. Ooh, red, okay. Has a yellow color, not bad, bro. Looks pretty clean. All of them look pretty clean. Yeah, boy, you know? Yo, what is up guys, it's your boy, the Salmo 2 one back with another Shindo Life video. On today's video, I'm going to be showcasing the 5 new weapons that came out on Shindo Life's recent update. Not only that, I'm also going to be showing you the newest codes that recently came out as well on the update. So yeah, just check the screen right now, the code should appear on it right now. I, I heard there's like 2 new codes or 1 new code, I'm not really sure. But yeah, just check the screen and any code that appears on the screen right now, redeem if you have any, alright? Because apparently the new code gives you 500 speed. Spins, bro so redeem it right now and spin for the cases you're missing but yeah with that being said we're gonna move on to the new weapons and i'm gonna start off by showcasing the obelisk she blade hopefully i pronounced it right for some reason i have a hard time pronouncing this right here but it is what it is all right so with that being said let me go to uh the training logs real quick and start showcasing this bad boy so yeah these weapons they look pretty cool bro not bad bro and i'm low key a fan of star wars so i'm hype you know when i heard these weapons were com coming out and when they came out i was pretty hyped bro pretty hyped not gonna lie so yeah we're here so let's showcase the weapons real quick but before i do let me show you how this bad boy looks in action so this is it right here not bad each one of them has their own colors and this one is black yes sir so with that being said we're gonna test the m1s on it real quick not bad bro that's pretty clean the noise the way it functions everything about it is pretty clean i'm messing with this weapon all right so with that being said and done we're gonna show off the special move for it so there's a special move not bad bro but i'm gonna have to give it an b a b not an a not an s and i'll tell you why because i feel like the special move is kind of hard to land on so like i mean to land so let's say you're, you're trying to land this move on a player and the player is moving around don't you think it's gonna be hard like you have to aim and not only that bro it's just hard to land bro you have to aim it perfectly and you just have to pray that the circles or attacks attacks not circles, Bruh. attacks land on your opponent because some of them they do hit in random spots but two of them they, they hit at the at the area you were aiming at so if you do aim correctly and you have good aim you're gonna at least like land two for sure you know what i mean two hits but not all of them so yeah overall this weapon is really hard to land the, the special move for it it's looking like it let me know in the comment section if it's easy to land if you guys end up messing around with it and all and it ends up being easy to land but by the looks of it to me it's not that hard to land so i'm gonna have to give it a b because of that but other than that this weapon is not bad it's pretty op and yeah with that being said we're gonna be moving on to the ember sheep blade so yeah let's show it off real quick and this one is honestly so far my favorite because you know it's red and red happens to be one of my favorite colors and not only that bro wait 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 wait, wait. i'm messing up <laughs> i messed up my fault all right check it out Ooh, red okay but not only that bro the special move for it is nice and easy to land like check it out bro the damage on it not bad bro and it does a uh, after damage which makes it even you know more op and the range on it is insane so i'm gonna use the special move for it once again and just focus on the special move bro just look at it and by looking at it you'll notice it's not that hard to land bro just look at the range on it insane bro insane so yeah that's the ember she blade for y'all moving on to the dune she blade so yeah let's show it off real quick um this is how it looks like give me one sec keep feeling at that for some reason but yeah this is how it looks like it has a yellow color and not bad bro it looks pretty clean all of them look pretty clean in my opinion all right so we're gonna use a special move for it real quick the damage on it is looking insane bro more than the the ember sheep blade but i'm gonna have to give it an a because the damage on it is pretty good and has after uh damage but it looks hard to land bro you gotta like be super close super close to your opponent to land that like tell me not bro like let's say let's say i'm over here right do you think i'm gonna be able to land the special move from over here i don't think so we're gonna have to see let's try it out real quick and uh see but i don't think so bro let's see oh damn okay okay this big actually got some range okay bro all right we're gonna try it from here all right so yeah just give it a second two one all right boom okay yo never mind bro all right we're gonna back up a little bit more 
If I land it from here, then I have no choice but to give this weapon an S instead of an A. Yeah, because if I land it from here, then insane, bro. Insane. I didn't land it. Alright, I didn't land it. And even if I landed it, I don't think I would have gave it an S because... You gotta keep in mind, bro. When people are molded up, and they have, you know, their mode and KG activated, they move pretty quick. So, like, let's say you, you know, you're aiming right there and your opponent's right there and you activate the move. You could just move and, you know, in less than a second, he'll be, he'll be away from the attack, bro. He'll avoid the attack that easily. So, yeah, honestly, honestly, bro, this could be a B, but I'll have to give it an A because of the damage, but... Yeah, like it's hard to land. It's gonna be really hard to land. It's gonna be like a whole mission <laughs> for you to land it, bro. You know, you're gonna be going on a whole mission to be able to land the attack on this move. But other than that, bro, the sword looks pretty clean. The special move, OP, and it's perfect other than that. But yeah, that's a Dunes, she, uh, Ember She Blade, and the Obelisk She Blade for y'all. And with that being said, I'll get back to you guys once these spawn and I get them. So once these spawn and I get them, I'll get back to you guys and I showcase these two bad boys for y'all. But other than that, I'll see you guys later. Alright guys, I'm back with the Nimbus Chi Blade. Chi Blade, yeah. So yeah, before I use a special move, let me show you the M ones. Same thing as the other Chi Blades. Same M ones. There was actually no need for me to show that, but... Yeah, that was the M ones, and now for the special move, the most important part, you know what I mean? So yeah, let me activate it real quick. Oh god, oh god, yo, yo, this is the first time using the special move for it, so yeah, I'm looking surprised at the moment. Damn, bro, I, I don't know what to say, bro, that looked mad OP, bro. I don't know if it's like hard to land, no, actually, it looks like it's not that hard to land, bro, wow, bro. This look like an S. Not really sure if I want to give this move an S. I mean, this blade an S, but... Hmm. I guess I'm gonna have to, bro. It's not that hard to land. And there's multiple attacks. And the damage on it is not bad, bro. And it has after, um, after damage. Not bad, bro. Not bad, bro. I'm liking this one. Not as much as the Ember one. Because the Ember one is really easy to land, bro. It's like the range on it is insane, but... This one, you can literally move it, like, move it while attacking with it at the same time. And change the direction of your attack, which makes it pretty nice, bro. But the only thing that makes it bad is that you have to be up close, bro. Like, for example, let's say I'm attacking from here. I don't think I can land my hits. Nah, I can't. That's the only bad thing about it. So, I might have to give this one an A. Yeah, I'm gonna have to give it an A just because of the range, bro. The range on it, it sucks. Other than that... Nice, I'm liking it, bro. Like, check out the special move, bro. God, bro. Yo, that's pretty insane. All right, so I'm gonna have to give it an A just because of the range. If the range was good on it, that would have been the new weapon I would have been using. I would have made this weapon, to be honest. But just because of the range, the range ruins it. So yeah, that's the Nimbus Sheep Blade for y'all. With that being said, I get back to you guys once I get the Haze Sheep Blade. Alright guys, we are back and I got the last she blade, alright? Which happens to be the Haze She Blade. So without any further ado, let's equip it and showcase this bad boy. Bro, I don't even have enough Rio, bro. Bro, I don't have enough Rio. That is tough. Alright, we are back and I got my boy. He got the new Haze uh, She Blade. So big shout out to my boy. Uh, I don't even know how to pronounce his name, but. Big shout out to you, bro. I really, really, really appreciate you, bro. The guy with the red name and this guy right here. Both of them. But especially the guy with the red name. He's been helping me like OD, bro. He helped me get one of the sabers. So, big shout out to him. But yeah, this is the Haze one right here. Okay. Attack each other real quick. Okay, let them both attack each other. And use the special move for it. Ooh, ooh, I like that move. Wow. Wow. Quick fight. Alright, they're gonna have a quick fight. Why not? You know what I mean? So let them have a quick fight. And uh let me use Spectate Mode show off this uh intense fight with the new She Blades. Okay, yo, they're going crazy. Yo, that special move for the Haze She Blade. Yo, it goes crazy, bro. It goes crazy. I'm liking it. I am liking it, bro. Alright, so 1v1 is intense so far 
And yo, I'm liking these new weapons, bro. The sounds, how they operate, everything, bro. The colors. Yo, I'm very, very happy and excited that they added these weapons, bro. Very excited. But yeah, check out this fight, boys. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying it. I am tense fight, bro. <laughs> Intense fight. And once again, bro, that special move for the Haze Blade is insane, bro. How it looks, the damage, and the stun on it. Insanity. Alright, so yeah, let's just let them finish this fight. Who do you guys think is gonna win? I'm thinking... I don't know. I don't know who's gonna win, bro. They're both going crazy, actually. I, at first, I was thinking the guy with the red was gonna win, but they're going. They're both going crazy, so I'm not really sure. Um, hmm. So it's gonna be intense, bro. I don't know what else to say. Got no more commentary. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what else to say. No, they're just going crazy. That's all I can say. <laughs> so yeah, I'll just put music in the background, and until they until they finish the battle. But I'm voting for the guy with the red because he helped me all day today. So yeah, I'm voting for him to win. But if he doesn't, it's okay. But yeah. Alright, uh, you know what? Let's stop the fight here. Okay, whoever has lower health is a loser. Y'all hope he doesn't lie, bro. Alright, so that's 160, uh... 160,000? Alright, so... He has... He has more health. He's a winner. Alright, so let me just wrap up this video. Yeah, he more hurt. <laughs> he more hurt, guys. <laughs> he more hurt. You could just tell by his clothing. So he won. He's probably capping. I don't know. But it is what it is, bro. That was an intense fight at the end of the day. But I honestly think this guy won right here. Just by, just by the clothes that this guy has. Before, when I said who won, his clothes was pretty ripped up. And, you know, you know, when it comes to this game, if your clothes is pretty ripped up, that means, yo, you got badly hurt, bro. This oh, yeah, world shall know right pain. Here.